This is Twit. Magic Leap One Creator Edition. Um, yeah, the SDK is, is open. It's a huge deal because, well, frankly, many of us, including myself, mm -hmm. speculated they had nothing or that they mm -hmm. weren't able to do what they had thought they were going to be able to do. And who knows what compromises this uh, creator's uh, edition will have. And if it's anything like HoloLens right. uh, or the early Oculus versions, they'll, you know, it will not be ready for prime time. That's probably why it's a creator's edition. And of course, that's a great look. And uh, you look like an idiot. But I think, <laughs> Amy, so you, you will say... Uh, well, you probably, you know, you look like an idiot now. You just used to it. I'm used to looking like an idiot personally. <laughs> you were a Google. You were you were a glass hole in the early uh, days. Oh, a proud <laughs> card carrying member of the glass hole community. Um, but there, there are essentially two things. If you think about cars and trucks, uh, Steve Jobs' uh, metaphor for yeah. uh, big, expensive desktops and lighter everyday use uh, I just devices. Bought a truck, by the way. <laughs> Tesla? No, an oh. iMac Pro. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Cost more than many Chevy trucks. Yes, yes. Uh, mm -hmm. Oh, 5000 I remember paying- 8000 the one 8, I bought. 8000 oh, Well, I knew Meltdown Inspector was going to really take away the performance, so I yeah. decided to get the 10 That's core. right. That's right. The money's not going to spend itself. It's going to be good for two years, though, before they force you to buy another one. Oh. Uh, Anywho, so the, so so the, the the Magic Leap and the, the, the HoloLens, these are the truck- of yes. trucks of they're for like, developers uh, they are for developers Early now days. but but i mean they're not just the trucks they're the atari 2600 so the strangest thing we're going to see in five years is people are going to be sitting at their desks with stuff like that like obtrusive yeah. uh, uh goofy looking things and they can have amazing things happening on their desk yeah. it's going to be a beautiful experience yeah. they're, they're going to look like idiots but it's going to be an amazing experience the other things happening are we going to call them leap holes i hope so <laughs> i i am uncomfortable just hearing that <laughs> <laughs> but but the other thing that's happening is that there are all kinds of there's all kinds of technology being developed for the lenses that will enable pretty ordinary looking glasses like Amy's glasses Th those we'll have glasses look like Amy's glasses in three four five six years that provide a a light version of yeah, that yeah. sort of uh, mixed reality. So this isn't experience. what you'll look like. You'll look like Amy. And this is the thing. It's like hard. Good. It's I know that it's hard for people to to grasp what Amy was saying, which is that which is that. The iPhone 10 will seem so dated and old yeah. fashioned and yeah. dull. And the, the thing that will make it seem so dull is once you have things floating in front of you, information flying in and out, uh, staring at this tiny little screen is going to be antiquated. Awful. It's going to be awful. Mm -hmm. 